Alexander. I Rob, thought. By the way, uh, uh, quick thing. Yeah. Uh, uh, put the hangout link in the chat, but also Tonka, if, if you would lay off the oxyberries just for a little bit, <laughs> it, it was Nevada state law that was being read, not a damn contract. Yeah, we read. Oh, he's a uh, Tonka's retired, it. but um, yeah, so we got this guy on recording. We started looking into him, found out his sister is actually a cop. So I actually called the police station that his sister is a cop at live on the air and reported him as a pedophile, and then the sergeant called me back, and I uh, got in touch with his father this morning to let him know that his son was saying that his father was giving him child porn on the air and was partaking and masturbating to child porn on the air, and uh, apparently now they're going to put him in a psych ward. Hopefully. But uh, he, he was trying wow. to argue it, saying, didn't you... He said, I didn't know the law, because he tried to tell me that like the child porn he had was legal or something. And he said, I didn't go to justice school. Like, what is justice school? And uh, Jim, got a, Jim got a huge kick out of that. He, he kept posting pictures of Phoenix Wright talking about justice school last night. Here, here, yo, guys, let's hop on to the, uh, the hangout. Uh, I'll link it Marty right down there. Bro. Yep, I'm going to link it down there. Because uh, 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 I'll Tim send was... it to, to Jim in case he wants. To. Yeah, I already sent it to him too. And then, okay, all right, yeah, dude. cool, cool, cool. So I'll meet you all, all over there. All right. All right. There we go. Do you guys hear me? Yeah, you hear me? Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, so call yes. you there. Can you hear me? Yes, yes, yes. Yep. Here. I'm just gonna boost up this. So uh, um, I, I'm, I'm guess, I hear that Tonka put a different name, a name like Steve on the account. No, I I, the I I made up the name of Steve as uh, as uh. a joke, as in like I don't know what the fuck his name is, Steve or some shit. Now uh, I don't know what the name is at, at all. Uh, Tim never told me what the name is, but apparently yeah, they I are different. Legal name. It's uh, it's Michael Pilkington. Uh, that is his legal name. He goes by Robbie because he doesn't want to use his father's name. Apparently, you can go by your middle name. Uh, on certain contracts, and that's what he's been doing. Um, but, you know, color me impressed. First, SBCC uh, calls up his mom, Carlot, and they pretty much say that he's working at the mom's used car lot. And then, you know, he tells everybody that he's, uh, he's he owns all these mansions and shit, and then he's posting pictures to trannies showing that he lives in his grandma's house. Which tranny is what? Yeah, he had a conversation with uh, with Johnny to whatever the hell it is, Johnny to Savage about five months ago, where he talked about how his his grandfather that was actually his uncle. Andy, can um, you hear me? Yes, yes. Yeah, there you okay, go. Okay, okay. I'm just making sure. I'm just making sure my mic is still fucked up. All right. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know there if you ever go. saw that, Andy, but he said that his uh, that his his uncle uh, was his father. And he posted all these pictures and said that his his uh, father was in the yeah yeah the yeah, yeah, yeah 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 I yeah, saw we that actually shit. we found that guy's Facebook turns out it's his uncle and those pictures were taken at his grandmother's house but he said that was his house Oops. and now that we see that he's working at his mom's car lot that would that would pretty much proves that he does live in Alabama he doesn't live in Florida he lives at his grandma's house and he works at the car lot he's not a rich millionaire he's a fucking bullshit well also didn't SVC call if, if if you don't know people SVCC right two C's yes. yeah he uh he does um uh like prank calls and prank called Tonka's mom which we played on the show the last uh Aworski show uh yeah that and that I think SVC asked is Robbie gonna be showing up at the car, uh, car lot and she goes well like whenever he does basically meaning like even his mom hates his work ethic Cause he's a fucking he's a he's miserable man. Like, what do you think I should do, Zoom? Did you hear about the um, new, uh, I new think, contract? I think you should sign it. I think he has gone out of his way to waste your fucking time. You have been training your ass off for the mm -hmm. past three months, and all this motherfucker has done is sit on live stream eight hours a day. And the only training I've seen him do is play fucking WWE 2K19 with fucking Akujin and fat ass Nick Diorio. I, I heard apparently <laughs> apparently uh, the rumor uh, around the mill the other day was that he has been training at universities. Oh, universities? What yeah. About American Top Team, we called them on your fucking show. No, 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 no. But but, but, but apparently he's been getting free training from people at universities. He's been heading to universities every single day training. Wait, he's actually getting trained by academics? <laughs> 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 I a nice little fucking mode, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, pretty much.
<laughs> it all comes f- full circle. What's up, Jim? How you doing, man? Uh, Andy, yeah, this is really amazing to me. I mean, it, he's done nothing but try to throw a wrench in the monkey works since the, the beginning of this. Didn't send in promo pics like he was asked. Didn't sign on camera like he was asked. Got his blood work in late. Had a different name on the signature or on the contract than on his blood work. Now he's contacting the promoter saying you're reading a contract on air. You don't have a contract in your hand. You weren't reading anything on air. Yeah, I was reading the Nevada law. Yeah, he's trying anything he can do to get away from this. All that tough talk, all the internet fight me in real life bullshit. And it's coming down to the wire where you're four or five days out. And he, he desperately wants to get out of it. And he wants to get out of it in a way that makes you look bad. And it's really fucking pathetic. I don't know, uh, you know, about these new stipulations and clauses, but I'm kind of in agreement with everybody else. I mean, at this point, you put your ass through all this training. You've gone through all this shit with this guy. Just sign the new contract. Go there and kick his ass. Yeah, I think I, yeah, no, I am. I, I, I'm going to get uh, a Tim Lloyd on too. I, I actually just texted him before my phone just died. Send the contract, I'll sign it. I'll sign it right now. I don't give a fuck anymore. Wait, can I, can I also, it live on the air, too. Yeah, yeah. Can I also throw this out, too? Mm. Tonka, for the last month, has run his mouth about Andy's, or even during that uh, interview that you guys did with mm. uh, that radio show, whatever it was, Andy doesn't respect the fight game. I respect the fight oh, game. Yeah. I have all this respect <laughs> for the fucking fight game. Well, Andy's the one that got his fucking blood work in on time. Andy's the one that did the contract signing. Andy's the one that fucking sent in promo pictures. If you respect the fight game so much, Tonka, why are you trying to fuck Valor fighting over so hard? Why are you trying to make Tim look like a bitch by screwing with his time money, fucking with the audience, and fucking with your opponent? Step up, Tonka. Step up uh, to the fucking ring. You know, ride he your little step metal up, bump. Jim. He can't <laughs> fucking walk. How is he going to stand up? <laughs> <laughs> Andy, Andy, maybe you could get Tim to add in a tag team stipulation so Donga can ride on the back of failure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yo, fucking th- this, th- like, I was, you know, at four o'clock when he didn't have his blood work in, even though I was pissed off, like, fuck all this, but I was, like, relieved in a way that I said, oh my god, I don't have to deal with this fucking, this hot and cold, hot and cold, hot and cold, and at 4.48 when I see, hey, he has it in, and then I go, okay, are we good? Well, let's see, uh, hang on one second, the commissioner, oh, there's a new contract. Oh, he won't sign it on camera. I'm like, holy! F- it's just it this this non, fucking stop, just f- mental anguish. He is literally a tumor that I can't wait to get removed. It's not gonna work though, Andy, because I don't know if you saw the one show that uh, Ralph had where me and him talked. If Tonka does not show up, Ralph and I are going to do a joint road trip <laughs> where we are going to drive down to Alabama and we are going to dual stream. On my channel and Ralph's channel, and we are going to show up at Tonka's mom's car lot, I'm in. at his mom's house, I'm in. and his Mima's house. And I'm going to sit down, I'm going to have some sweet tea with a southern <laughs> belle named Sarah, and we're going to talk about the Bradley family, and about Tonka, and where this myth that he's a fucking <laughs> Indian came from. And we're going we're gonna to set this straight. And I don't Triple care stream. If he shows up, I'm, I'm there. Gonna fucking, I'm going to wear a suit and everything, so is Ralph. And if he tries anything, I'm going to knock him into next week. We'll have our Sunday best on. By the way, Andy, the chat is just going nuts. You, you need to turn up the volume. I did the, boost you guys. I, I did I did boost. Hang on. Hang on. I'll do it more. Sorry. I, go ahead. Talk for a second. Hello. Hello. Uh, <laughs> this, I mean, it sounds loud to you, but when you're watching, I can't really hear anything. Uh, it must be what, where the uh, – there's so much – Yeah, yo, like, like honestly, at, at this point, hang on, wait, let me go like this, like, like that, boom, yeah. I don't know, Chad, can you hear it? Uh, well, I have everything fucking boosted max. I have like everything like blasting right now. What the fuck? That's that's fine. They can they can adjust. Yeah, we might just have to deal with it. Yeah. Stick it, stick your ear next to the speaker. <laughs> hang on, hang on. I'll 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 fix this for the. In my pixel art that I've been doing my game and uh, I've been getting good actually in in the game I'm making we actually do have a little tribute to Tonka. So, uh, so, he's so cal thought of it, so 
Tonka, you're in a game. <laughs> okay. It's like the promoter retweeted fucking TonkaSaw.com. All the people are like, <laughs> is that OB laughing at the bar? <laughs> They're going to see the video where I make fun of him and all the fan art that all the people have made. Facebook Messenger. <laughs> I, I saw he tried to bring Joya on to try and like make himself look like less of a piece of shit. So I just did a stream right after that where I showed all of our conversation between me and Joya where she talks about how he beats women and how he's a, he's got a his erectile dysfunction and all this shit. And it, it fits it because cause apparently out, Cog way. said that he uh, that his dick was broken too. Uh, Cog had like a special conversation with Vamp and apparently Tonka has erectile dysfunction. No! So, yeah. No, wait, 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 Andy, <laughs> did, you, did you turn the volume down on the stream? No, it sounds good now, I think. Oh, I think it, he finally, it, got, it, yeah, he, he I finally it. got At first, it was actually lower, but now I think he figured it, it out. Oh, like, okay. Is this one? I was going to repeat that, the erectile dysfunction bit, because I want them <laughs> yeah. to hear that. I don't want them to miss okay. it. <laughs> so yeah, I so when I, when I talked to Joya, she said, that, uh, she said that Tonka had problems getting hard. And that he had erectile dysfunction. <laughs> and then when I talked to Cog, he said that half the reason why Vamp fucked Joaquim and cheated on Tonka was because Tonka can't get a heart on him. The last <laughs> time she went down there, they tried to have sex and Tonka couldn't get hard. So not only can Tonka not stand on his own two legs, but his dick can't stand at attention either. You're telling me Chief Ganga's totem pole doesn't stand <laughs> full math? Is that what I'm hearing? No, it does not. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, man. I... I I'm just like I, I won't lie like the, obviously the first few weeks of the whole training and the fight thing I was pretty anxious and nervous you know kind of like we done this before and now I'm like fucking come at me I am willing to get my ass kicked at this point I don't give a fuck if he's 200 pounds I don't care if he beats the weight if he passes the weight I'm like I don't care just fucking fight. Yeah, what is up with that story? He told everybody that he was trained. I remember this. It was like five months ago. And he said he trained and that he'd been fighting in a secret circuit. I'm assuming the real Kumite, like fucking Frank DeRoe. And he said that he was he was training. He was in shape. He was at the top of his game. And him and Failure kept talking about his fight game and all these fights that he'd been in. And then and then the minute this comes up with you, he's like, oh, well, I'm actually 196 pounds. I'm 30 pounds overweight. And uh, I've been eating a lot of Chinese food and drinking beer and popping Xanax all day and smoking weed. And now I got to lose 30 pounds to be in fight with you, to be able to fight Andy. And it's like, uh, that's Wait, a completely different story. He said that? Yeah, he said he had to lose 30 pounds, that he was 196 pounds when you guys were going to fight. And when he started training, he had to lose yeah. all this weight to fight you. Apparently, he was on celery soup or something for two weeks. Yeah, celery weeks. soup, and he was in yeah. the fucking, he I was swear. sweating it out in the sweat and the yeah, fucking sweat sauna. Box. Yeah, oh. yeah. I'm so what removed from Tonka. Like, I remember the, it was Ralph. You brought him up about me being missing on a milk carton or something. And yeah, like, we oh. talked about that that day, and they had on the Kumite the thumbnail. They had like Andy Worski missing on a on a milk carton. Yeah, yeah, and uh, and then like I remember when you said that, I was like, oh yeah, Tonka. I forgot about this guy. <laughs> I've been so focused on training, like like his show is Kumite is it doing well. I'm assuming it's it's pulling in numbers. No. Oh yeah, no. it's killing it. Yeah, it's yeah. killing it. Yeah. Fair enough. Total Holy renaissance shit. there. You know, Andy, too, what I really liked was with that radio interview uh, and the article they put up. Because Sanka told everybody, I'm, I fought an MMA. I did three MMA matches. Yeah. I, I did professional shit. And they're like, this is his MMA debut. They completely blew him out of the fucking water on that. And he didn't <laughs> fix it. He didn't, like, like fix. He didn't go, actually, you fucked up. It's not that. Because if I was in MMA before, I'd be like, hey, guys, when you change that on the website, that's not my MMA uh, debut. You might have to change that. And they'd be like, all right. No, he just nope. leaves it because he's he's never fought in MMA. Do you know how annoying it's been to explain to people in my real life? They go, this guy did wrestling before. And I'm like, okay, where do I start? He's done acting before. Where do I start? Yeah. And they're like, well, wrestling is still kind of fighting. I'm like, I'm like, fucking put it on YouTube right now. Let me show, like, I'm actually going to show one of those fights right now. <laughs> I, like, explaining this to people has been so infuriating. I'm like, no, he stinks. He's a, he's a meth head. And they're like, and I'm like, he's in a wheelchair. He's a meth head. And they're like, you're going to fight a meth head in a wheelchair? <laughs> I'm okay with fighting a meth head in a wheelchair. That's preferred at this point. At least it's something. Holy fuck. I bet the Kumite, they're going to be pretty disappointed when Tonka shows up and he's not an actual cartoon character. <laughs> 
I just I love the story. I, I, I love the storyline of this. You've got an overweight, crippled, limp dicked Indian getting trained by a fucking university academics to fight you for internet shit, and he's not even gonna show up. It all makes sense now. I, I think... look, look at his stance right there. Yeah, yeah. Like that, eh? <laughs> I, I I think that his um that I was told that to like that was like a, like his seventeenth Hail Mary. Like, hey, you know, someone spread around the rumor that I've been training every single day with uh, at universities. You know what I said to the person who told me that? I went, good, a challenge. <laughs> and I went back to fucking doing my thing. Like, I'm okay with getting my ass kicked. I don't give a fuck. I just want to fight him now. I don't care. And now, like, after all this stuff, now he's going to get... Talk, if you do show up, man, this beating is going to be worse than before, man. I swear to fucking God. Oh, man, look at these moves. Oh, I'm so fucking worried. How, oh, how is the uh, how is the promoter not pissed off? Like, he, that's he, the thing that gets me. Like, if I set this uh, thing up. I know Tara is pissed off shit, because he threw her under the bus. Oh, wait, he did? Yeah. He okay, said I, that she peer pressured him into the fight that oh, he never yeah. wanted it. <laughs> she, yeah, yeah, he, she ran, ran over, it. backed it up, put it in reverse, and did it again. By the way, Andy, have you heard back from the promoter yet? Oh, uh, hang on. Uh, he didn't email me yet. Look at him. He just he can't even take a slap in the chest. He's just so defeated. Well, he looks like he's wrestling out of Auschwitz. Like <laughs> <laughs> See, I would say oh he's God. an enhancement talent, but he doesn't even do them justice. <laughs> And look at the ring. That's got to be like that, those are like the four foot height. Like I think they're like five five. And look at it. He's barely over the fucking uh, top of the rope. You know it's so Chief funny. Chief Zycon of up. the Limp Dick Tribe. <laughs> you know, it's so funny, by the way. Watching the uh, I, I saw it on my last show. We watched the AI use um, a promotion, like his video, his edited video. Like listening to that now in hindsight, with after everything that's happened. It's just fucking funny. The confidence. Pussy, you're a pussy. Pussy. Oh, please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Like, like, and now we're here. And me going, oh, please fight me. You fuck. <laughs> I just want to taste your blood if you're not HIV positive. I don't know at this point. <laughs> Holy fuck. He is fucking... I'm not even mad. I'm just like, holy shit. I you think that Crowd is the one that introduced him to all these academic wrestlers that can help him? <laughs> He's like, I, I have some real good friends. Uh, my, my friends, they introduced me to some very important people. And, and my name's Joseph Lancaster. I'm going to help you become yeah. a true wrestler, Tom. He also well, helped is, is it with a... erectile dysfunction. Yeah, is it, a support, is it a support group for people with dick injury? Like, it's really weird, isn't it? <laughs> holy, yo, and... Like, isn't that fucking funny that, like, we're doing this stream for a little bit, and then the first thing I receive from Tim is, hey, are you reading the contract? Like, no, no, why, why would I fucking pull the plug after all of this? After, you don't understand, this training, for, like, the first three weeks were horrific. Now, now it's fun and I like it, but the, the training still, it's like, Hey, I, I wish I could be like streaming or making a video or working on my video g game. No, I got to spend three hours at the fucking gym and then come back, have a protein shake, have a creatine thing, and then fucking relax for a bit and blah, 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 every fucking day. And then and the days I take off, I feel like shit. I feel like an asshole. I feel like, fuck. Like I fucking By the way, Andy, uh, there's, uh, there's been a leaked photograph of Tonka. Uh -oh. uh, I, put it, I put it over in the sidebar. <laughs> Uh, this this is apparently uh, just from a few moments ago there at the uh, reservation. Okay, let's. Put it up here. Look at the oxycodone. <laughs> Let me make sure it's centered proper there. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna That's fucking I'm gonna head a Walmart and have this fucking blown up into an actual poster size. <laughs> oh Tonka, you like this this is the most embarrassing like
so you know when me and him were first angry at each other and fighting and all that stuff and it's all spurgy i've i've transcended that into like more like uh it's like whenever he says something it, it, instead of me being angry this is what i hear do 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 Bong, <laughs> like, like a, like a fucking sitcom. Like Andy said this. Oh, did he? Like it's just like it's sitcom music. He's a, he's not. He doesn't anger me anymore. And and so Cal would be like, Yo, hey man, you hear? The, I hear this clip. I'm like, Nah, don't even care. Don't want to hear it. Just don't. Not interested. Oh, wait, wait, Andy. If Tonka is telling the promoter you're reading the contract on air and he's making bullshit up, but he's probably watching right now. Do you want to give him a direct message? Oh yeah. Tonka, p -p -p please, please show up at the fucking fight. <laughs> I bought fucking plane tickets, and me and Ralph got a house. You idiots! <laughs> like we got, I gotta fucking go on a plane in three days. I gotta take all the fucking all my debit cards and Visa cards and wash them in the fucking sink before I. Talk. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was a coke joke, by the way. Um, yeah, I, I fucking. I'm excited though. You know what, man? Out of all this, like, you know, meeting you, Ralph, and fucking Dick Masterson, we're gonna run to a fucking venue. I get, I'm still allowed in the middle of the octagon with a who's who's playing fucking commercials. No, that was the sound of a crashing wheelchair. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Can you, can you hear a really angry Indian screaming goose? Oh, sorry about that. I accidentally crashed Tonka's wheelchair. I was trying to, <laughs> trying to put him up. That, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a work, you goofs. I'm, uh, oh, I'm, I'm doing the soundboards because Gator's not here. <laughs> I want to ask you all, I want to ask you all, uh, what did you all think? Because it's a, it was uh, more in my favor, but the reaction of you know, failure going oh, with that pedal shit and all that, like bashing me. And then I pulled the 1200 uh, from underneath him. <laughs> oh, I thought that was hilarious. <laughs> did, did you see the, the stream that I did? I actually found that fucking chick, uh, Sarah. They lied about all of that, Andy. Fucking Davis and, and Anal Vape knew her for months. Do you remember that chick, uh, Delightful Honey or Delicate Honey that fucking geek banned from the chat because she wouldn't stop fucking spamming and obsessing about I, you? I don't. I, I don't. That was okay. her. I've, I've that was a few her. people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, all right. That, that was who she really was. She was this chick that was obsessed with you. And apparently after you blocked her, she started hanging out with anal vape and they hatched this whole gay plan to make you look like a pedophile. I have all of her shit. I did a whole review stream about it on stream me I where I found her. I matched all the videos up. You can hear her voice. It matches the same voice as Sarah. And then you look and I actually found her personal Twitter and everything. And guess who's following her? Davis and fucking anal vape. So for somebody who said that they barely knew the girl and she oh. disappeared why do they have her personal accounts followed how how horrible actually zoom medicare and ralph you were all there on that day the day that all this stuff came out the day i was actually a day after or two days after and i went on your stream ralph and i had all that circumstantial evidence and it looked like i had a fucking a you know tin foil hat but ralph you let me at least speak my piece which i appreciate and defend myself but like that was, I'll say that four days until I did the stream with the leaked audio because Rari said like fucking, fucking like, uh, thank God that Rari did that, man. I, 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 I'll always respect him for that. But that four days of my life was the worst four days ever. Like literally I wanted to just die. I wanted to die. Like that feeling of, you know, we believe you, Andy, but there's always that, like, eh. That's why I was, like, fucking, like, a madman. Just And now here we are. Where, you, Zoom, you're the one who confronted me. You're the one who was, who was pressing me. You were being yeah, fair. Yeah, right? I, I, I was giving you the same amount of skepticism as you and Ralph gave me. I wasn't saying it was 100%. I said I want, if I, I would be willing to admit I was wrong if I was wrong. And then I actually sat down with them and and they started telling me the other side of the story and then the girl wanted to back out she had ralph like like literally we were on air and she's like oh i don't want to do it anymore then i'm hearing that davis is convincing her off the air to not do it and i'm like why is davis telling her not to do it he was the one pushing this the hardest 
And then the more I looked at it, and then and then she's gone. Then she her account's deleted. She's gone off of Twitter. Everything that we were contacting her on, she's mysteriously gone. And I had no problem, you know, admitting that I was wrong with Ralph, and I can admit it now. I was wrong about it. Uh, you know, we talked about it privately, me, you, and Geek. And uh, I apologized mm-hmm. to you, and we uh, we went over everything. And then I actually went out, and I found the fucking girl that did it. And I did a whole stream about who she really was. That, it like, was all a gay op. All because... All because I was like, uh, <clears throat> I was like, whoops! All because I was like, yeah, um, I, yeah, I don't want anal vape on my show anymore for now. I want to, because he was doing weird shit, <clears throat> and then oh, because of the thing about him getting caught hitting on a sixteen-year-old. Oh, black that's girl. what it was. That's what it was. Yeah, because I didn't defend He's, him. On he that. said he was gonna he was gonna wreck her with his uh, superior Hispanic white cock. Yeah, and then use the she exact was like same thing. Yeah, and he yeah, used the exact fucking same weird. Thing Yo, I, yo, honestly, man, it's like, at, at this point, with, with like, I'm so glad the way everything has has turned out. And then you have fucking, what, what is it, fucking Kraut. And it's like, you guys are doing another fucking, another Discord? Like, what is wrong with you? Like what is you know, wrong? I, uh, I'm, I'm getting messages, Andy, from uh, from some sources. Mm. They're saying that Tonka, as of uh, a few weeks ago, uh, legally changed his name to Robbie on purpose in an attempt to prevent uh, to you know fuck ah! with you and have the contract oh God, uh, re- I, I, redone. I, I fucked up my my hang on, video capture device. Fuck, where'd you go? Oh, I fucked everything up. Uh, there you go. Yeah. Oh my God. So you... they're, they're saying that he legally changed his name to Robbie because it was Michael. And they're saying that he did it on purpose. And this is a trusted source. Uh, you know, I could so, say who it is in the side chat. So he, yeah, please say it. So Tonka's Hail Mary was to legally change his name so it would fuck up the contract. <laughs> It's unbelievable. See, see the side chat? Uh, okay, hang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, hang on. Uh, who, 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 wait, sorry, I, I missed, um, the name. Let me see. No way! <laughs> Tonka! Oh my, he changed his name to fuck up the contract. Hands in his blood 48 minutes late. Won't sign it live. You know what? Yeah, he he's You're trying right. to do everything he can to fuck up the fight. Uh, he wants to delay it without saying I don't want to show up. He's he's trying every fucking trick in the book. It's pathetic. Oh my god. Hang on. Let's see. Tim, where's fucking Tim Loy? What the fuck, man? He's probably dealing with a screaming Indian right now. <laughs> yeah, he's doing. Hang on. Yo, <laughs> fuck it, this fucking guy. Failure, failure. Tell him I didn't do that. Tell him it's a lie. I, got... mean, I got my dude failure here. He'll tell you. Hang on. I Tim, ha- I'm sorry. <laughs> I have my uh, I have my charger upstairs. Let me just grab it real quick, so then I can phone him, and then I'll ask him what the deal is because he said 15 minutes. 40 minutes ago. So it is, this is probably Tonka. I, I, I guarantee you it's a screaming Indian. Yes, I can, I can fucking feel it in my bones. Yo, let me uh, grab, yeah, let me g- g- grab um, uh, my charger. I'll be back in a sec, all right? Yeah, let me, yeah, let me put on the, uh, the fucking hilar- hilarious, oh, sorry, the exquisite fighting that we have from Tonka here. Hang on, how do I do this? I really think Taka should show up. I mean, Andy, you might be able to cure him by beating the fuck flu right out of him. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I... Do you think... Like, there's no way he'll he'll fucking ever live this down, by the way. Oh, no, I won't let him. If he doesn't fucking show up, I like I said earlier, we'll go down there. We'll go to his fucking hometown. I have no problem knocking on the door, talking to his Nima. I don't care. We, What's he going to do? Yeah, we found his trailer because... Um, his brother or his uh, stepbrother is a pedophile, convicted pedophile. So he's on the convicted pedophile Oh, which list. one? Because I, I know that... Uh, the one with glasses Chant and long him. hair? Yeah. Uh, Chant, Andy, Chant they're, they're, saying he's, uh, they're saying he's in your chat right now. Oh, it's Bradley. Nah, that's a fake one. Oh, I see. I was getting all hopeful. Yeah, you have I a know. really angry, oxy-buried fucking donga on here. Oh, he uh, doesn't have the balls to do that. <laughs> Yo, yo, I... Well, he's definitely 1,000% watching. I mean, oh, you that's think he's watching? Where he <laughs> well, yeah, he has to be. Oh, Andy's reading the contract. Oh, oh my God. How did... Like, how do you... 
he's reading the contract. Oh, oh, did you hear Medicare? Did you hear this, oh, this one? I know everyone else here heard this one, but did you hear how on Friday he he tried to quite a few years of wrestling uh, Wait, sorry. over uh, Alabama and Georgia. Yeah, sorry, different this, parts this of the southeast here. And Stop it! He's been a heck of a talent for many years. What oh See God. what happened? See, he's throwing you off your game. You went, what was it, two months of training and you started celebrating early with some beer and already you've forgotten how to operate your fucking no. stream. No, OBS. Oh, I had to, I had to install the normal OBS. OBS, uh, stream, stream Live's OBS is not working. So it's, it's all fucked up. But what I was saying was, Fuck, what was I saying? Chris? Exactly. That's the alcohol. I'm trying to get you out of the mindset of training. No, no, it was um fuck. Hang on. Someone in chat remembers what I was saying I was saying. Uh hang on. Du -du -du -du. Okay, boomer, boom tar, low IQ, stop being a boomer. I think it was about him showing. He better show up. He's pop something about Friday. Yeah, you were talking about how he had said something on Friday. Oh yes, thank you. There, that that worked. Thank. Uh, he tried to say that I was going to cause a bomb threat. Oh yeah, I saw people in the side chat saying that I was going to do it for you and that we're working in cahoots. I want to see him get his fucking head punched in. Why the fuck would I do that? I told Tim that I'm like, fucking Zoom has been messaging me, cheering me on, excited, excited to see this. Um, this match. Why the fuck would he throw throw it all away? For for what? For people running out of a building for fucking two hours? Like what the fuck? Everybody wants to see that. I, I you know <laughs> we're watching it on pay per view, right? Like everybody wants to watch this fucking fight happen. There's only one side not turning in their fucking paperwork and their blood work and doing the promo shots. That's Donga's side. He's the only one of the reason to try to weasel out of this. We should you know what's funny about this, clip. Andy, is yeah, sure. uh, the last time we were all on air, you know, Jim, you, me, Ralph, it was me, and you guys were all on the other side, and Jim was just standing there counting his super berries, enjoying the fucking gas fire that was uh, what IBS Bless was. The past, yeah. Ah, yeah. shit, that and, was uh, <laughs> You know, I was like... I was like, this dude is a fucking bullshitter. He's a liar and he's a piece of shit. And you guys were just like, well, he's our friend. You know, it's okay. And now eight months later, everybody sees I was right. And he only, was a fucking piece of shit. Only eight months? It feels like 17 yeah. and a half years, dude. That's fine. <laughs> like internet years? Like, like, internet like it's, I know eight? it's crazy for you, but just imagine how it is for me. I was the one that had the tinfoil hat on going, this dude's a fucking liar, <laughs> piece, lying piece and of shit. I had and everybody on. was like, Everybody was like, no, he's 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 a fighter. He's look at all this yeah. stuff. He couldn't be lying no, no, about it. The, the, so the best was SoCal. One day he phoned me. He goes, hey, Andy, you know how I hated you for a long time? You were right about Tonka. Like, this is like a few months ago. Like, slowly everyone's going, do, 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 like, going over the fucking line. Like, nope, fuck this guy. And, uh, yo, okay, before I get off track, I need to grab that charger and phone Tim. Tim Loy. Hey, uh, hey, take a look at the side chat. Thing. Tonka's saying you won't sign Andy, and then Vamp is saying spam sa sign the clause, Andy. I will. I will. Oh my god, this is like a repeat. I'm having flashbacks from. Yeah, see, that's what I was saying earlier. They they 100 are trying to get you not to sign it, Let's so sign. then they can take that back to the Kumatards and say, "Oh, Andy won't sign the contract." Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna bring that charger ASAP because I need to call Monsieur Tim Lloyd. Uh, well, stop talking about it and go grab it. Yeah, go call it. I like to leave <laughs> things in suspense, Jim. All right, BRB. I'm waiting for him to run back and be like, well, one more thing before I go grab the hang fucking on, hang on, hang on, Before I go. Why are you I heard you say that. My headphones are loud. My headphones are loud. Okay, one second. Oh, shit. <laughs> wow. Can be nothing can be easy with this. I, I gotta pull the room, guys. So what do you think? Do you think this is gonna happen or not? It feels like Donga's really trying to weasel out of it. So what he's, do you think? He's doing everything he can to get out of it, but I think no. it will happen. At this point, do you really? I, I, I don't think, think he's coming. If, he, if if all this contract stuff goes through, I, I think it does, and I think oh, I don't know. But I think Andy wins regardless. That's I mean, I was the one saying for months that he was gonna show up. 
but the stuff that I've seen since Friday and then today. Well, like I told you the other I day, know. Ralph, I, I called all the major hotels in Knoxville and he doesn't have any bookings. There's no bookings under any of the names. Then that again, we know the market. weight could be an issue. Like if he missed weight. Well, he I could you have an Airbnb. Getting a room. <laughs> like he's too fat to fit in the fucking hotel. <laughs> <laughs> Airbnb? You honestly think that these people have credit cards? I mean, fucking Vamp lives with her well, mom. No, no, Uncle lives with his maybe. grandma. Like, come on. Uh, do you take super berries? I got a whole basket of them. Failure. That's some moxy ones left. In the parking lot. Use your stomach as a moon bounce. Get the kids jumping on you for 10 bucks. <laughs> you got to pay up bills. I, I really oh. didn't think, I, I didn't think he could afford to pussy out, but I, I'm starting to, I'm having my doubts now. Like it, waiting this long and then doing it at the last minute, I, I think the reality of the situation is hitting him and he's freaking the fuck out. I mean, I really, really want it to happen, and I've been saying that he would do it forever, but at this point, I I don't know. I think it's very much in doubt. Yeah, and I see the screenshot. This is Tonka in his Discord saying, going to be hard when he won't sign, and then, yeah, there's Vamp saying, uh, guys, seriously, spam, sign the clause, Andy. I, well, I knew it wasn't going to happen when he said, when him and Failure said that he was training an American top team, because I have friends that, that uh, you know, train and uh, like I have two friends that do uh, workouts in the UK with people that, uh, that do UFC professionally, and they know people at top team. And when I asked my friend, I was like, hey, can you ask one of your people that you train uh, how top team works and if they train amateurs? And he was like, no, they don't train amateurs at all. They have amateur Same. classes, but they don't let pros and amateurs train together. And then when we call called them on the air i had the dude uh i think his name was caleb he was like the head dude that does all the accounting and all the stuff and all the management and booking for the classes and i talked to him for about an hour and it was me and andy and geek and we were alone and i let them listen to me talk to the dude and the dude was like no we we never do eight hour classes we do four hours barely and you'll get those four hours maybe in a week not a day he's like we're so packed and we have so many classes that are so booked that we can't do eight hour training sessions. He's like, the pros don't even do eight hours. They do four hours a day. And that's max. Some, some reporters, some journalists that are in MMA that I know, and they, they call bullshit on the whole thing too. Well, he they also said he was, he was swimming, that he was, uh, he was throwing sandbags. The guy's like, we don't have a swimming pool here. So I don't know where the hell he's swimming. And he's like, and that would never be in the training regiment. And we don't have sandbags here either. So I don't know what this dude's talking about. He sounds like he's full of shit. And I fucking cracked up when the guy said it. The only reason I say that there's a possibility is because well, I want to hear what Tim has to say because he knows more on it. And I, I, I've heard Tim before and I, I trust his, you know, what he says because he, he says he's never seen something like this before. Then it does cause reason for like what what's your in game here? You know, like you're not going to get out of this unscathed. There's no way. Well, I, 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 do they have penalty clauses? I would hope so. Like, you can't get this. We've, never seen, we've never seen the contract. Only they have. Yeah. But it'd, I, be I, up I, to, it'd be up to Tim Lloyd to disclose whether or not there's penalties. Yeah, I'm hoping, I'm hoping Tim goes into some detail, at least vague, if he can't give specifics. But I, I don't want to see Dongo walk away from this. Like, uh, that you know, he can waste everybody's time. <laughs> walk away. <laughs> <laughs> Wheel away. <laughs> Rolling, rolling, rolling. I'm a little bit he, he also said something I really forgot, weird on I, stream. He said that he I, made weight. I almost weight. forgot we were streaming. Oh, you did? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, my, I, a phone should be charged in just a second. It's been plugged in for a minute. Like, okay. Yeah, but yeah, he said he made weight, you were saying? Yeah, didn't you think that was a bit weird? He said he made weight. Normally, they try to stay either a few pounds above or a few pounds below their, their goal weight. And then they go sit in the sauna or they, you know, try to pack on some pounds to gain an extra two pounds right before the fight so that they make that goal weight. Mm. I've never heard of somebody making weight two weeks before because then you could you could fuck up and you could have a huge shift and you could gain 10 pounds. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I, you don't I'm, do having, trouble, I'm having trouble passing the 160 and then staying there because it's like, like from all the cardio and, and all that stuff, it's like. I'll be like 161. I'm like, yeah, I did it. And it's like 158 the next day. I'm like, all right, let's eat some more, you know, stuff and, and work yeah, out harder. Yeah, I have a friend that did that. He was, uh, he was like 140 and he started bulking up. And this dude is fucking eating 6,000 calories a day. And he always posts on Snapchat. He, he's got pretty much stuck. Mm. He was stuck at 160 to 166 for about 
five and a half months before the gains pushed him over and now he's up to 170 now yeah I'm, sometimes you just you plateau and you just got to push through yeah, it. yeah i think i i plateaued because i'm like literally yeah i've had about five thousand calories a day and this is like all healthy shit there's no fucking fast food uh there's none of, it's, just, it's like fucking you know chicken quinoa rice potatoes protein shake protein shake protein shake my fucking my ba- my roommate said this i uh, said it best uh, yesterday um or the other day that our house smells like a fucking sewage treatment plant it's fucking horrific <laughs> uh like um it's it's been tough and then the creatine that you have to drink tons of fucking water and then you're sweating it out it's it's so you're on pre workout hmm? yeah 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 it's nice to see somebody on real pre-workout, not that pre-workout that Failure says that he's on, where he takes it, and then he says he sits there and shakes while he sits on stream for two and a half hours. I've never seen somebody take pre-workout and then sit on stream for two and a half hours like it's not going to make them want to rip a fucking phone book in half. Oh, dude, when I get yeah, yeah, the, the, the creatine I, I'm taking, like, after you're just like, all right, it's like drinking a Red Bull. That's what it feels like, but without the heart palpitations. Oh, uh, hey, Andy. Um, up on Kiwi, uh, they're posting screen caps that look doctored, saying that you were telling people uh, he's saying that he won't show up, even if he does. Zoom already said he's going to call on that bomb threat. And that's what Tonka uh, said. Well, uh, yeah. everybody on Kiwi Farms are pedophiles, so don't listen to what they say. <laughs> that's exactly what I fucking I I told Tim. It's they're trying absolutely anything, and then I was like, "When did he send you this?" And he sent it what like last week or something. And it was funny because I hadn't been on Discord for, I think, four or five days. So Cal can actually attest to this. Remember when I went MIA for like a few days? Yeah, I kept telling you what was all was happening. Cause, yeah, because Tonka's right. trying to say that's why they want a new. That's why he wanted a new contract because of the because of the screenshot. Because, uh, because I had he a, made him. I had a family. I, I had a family death. I was off Discord, and I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah this is fucking am- amazing. What? Well, the same the same guy posting that is posting, I guess, messages Tonka sending out to people from the promoter. Yeah, it's one hundred percent some Tonka scrub. Uh, and what did it say? Uh, it said, "I'm going to see if they will let me change the contract." The owner also now wants you both to sign an additional agreement that covers us in case of sabotage. Uh, and then there's a second one that says, "But Andy insists on a video of you signing." I don't work for Andy. I can hand you a video, but that guy's absolute shit. And then he says uh, he thinks you are sending someone else to fight in your place. What? Yeah, well, I did say that. I did say that. No, no, yeah, but that's what I'm saying. So, uh, yeah, he's he's dropping all of this, trying to make it look like, yeah, just sign the fucking contract. And I am. Up. He's looking for any way to weasel out of this. If you sign yeah. it, he has no fucking excuse. I, I want to see him get his ass beat so bad. Okay, so the so Tim, he goes, I can come on tomorrow briefly, but tonight isn't gonna work. This shit has me running late to dinner tonight with my wife and kids. <laughs> Waiting on me while my phone blows up. So now he's affecting this guy's time with his wife and children. Get it together, Tonka. I agree. I agree. I agree. Like holy fuck! You've had three <laughs> months to get this shit in, and you fucking know it. You're you're wasting this fucking people's time. You're wasting the promoter's time. You're wasting your fans' time. Now you're doing a disservice to your own fucking fans who have bought uh, tickets, who have saved up money, who have not paid their trailer dues and utilities mm-hmm. to fucking be able to afford a digital ticket or even to fly out there. And those fu- hookups aren't free. Yeah, that shit ain't free. Now you're fucking your own fans over who have invested no, money no, and time. Um, remember, he actually told his fans, do not buy tickets. If you're, go- if you're going to buy pay-per-view, use Andy's code. <clears throat> Don't fly out. Don't. He, he said that from the, the beginning. He said he made sure that his fans... That was like the first like, okay, why wouldn't you want your fans to be there to support you? Like, what the hell are you talking about? It's horrible at mind games. But yeah, there are no, people that bought himself. tickets. There, there are kumatards that said they there bought are. tickets and they're going to be there in Knoxville. Yeah. The, oh, now, is he oh, just going to send you the contract? The, the promoter, what did he say about that? Yeah. So I, so I just texted him. Uh, can uh, Tonk is sending out your text with him. LOL. Can you send the contract? He's saying I won't sign. I am signing 100%. Like there's nothing, I have never struggled so hard. This 
the Neither is Tim. This <laughs> yeah, yo, 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 this like situation is more of a battle than the actual fight itself, to be honest. Like, I would rather just train and train for a fight than deal with this shit ever again. Holy fuck. And then if I didn't sign, if I didn't do anything, pussy, 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 pussy. I, if any of his fucking, if the Kumatards believe that I'm either A, a pussy, B, going to back out, or any of I want to talk to AIU. Atheism is unstoppable because he was the biggest, biggest fucking cunt out of everyone. Oh, it's this that you sent, by the way. Apparently, Tonka is saying that uh, that he doesn't work for you and that he's going to give the video to his fans of him signing it, but he's not going to do any videos and show you. How? That he, how, is the, how, how is this... How is this ma- Magic of sending it to everyone except for me. That's okay. He's gonna meet you <laughs> in a few days. So yeah, that's yeah, on. man. Oh my god, you. You're not invited in the teepee. What can I say, Jim? <laughs> <laughs> like no. it's not gonna get out. Uh, I wanted oxies. <laughs> There's another Discord. I mean, people are leaking from his Discord love, and uh, he said he never wanted. He's talking about you. He never wanted this fight. This was just some some bullshit bravado move, piece of shit. That's what he's saying on Discord, apparently. Oh, he's backpedaling. How can a man in a wheelchair play it? (laughs) Play the audio. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'll play the audio. You guys won't be able to hear it, unfortunately, but I'll play it for the audience. Okay, let's let's hear this. Yeah, I'll I'll fight Geek, but Andy Wars gets it. All right, let me boost up my Discord. I think I'll hear this. Yeah, I'll, I'll fight Geek, but Andy Worski will fight me. Dude. That if Andy Worski did not. Oh my God! Geek doesn't get any of my time. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I'll, I'll fight Geek, but Andy Worski will fight me first. If Andy Worski doesn't fight me, then I'm not. Yeah. Yeah, Geek yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll fight Geek. Yeah, but yeah, I'll, 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 fight... I'll, I'll, I'll fight Andy Worski first. If, uh, if I don't fight Andy Worski, then Geek gets none of my time. Let's hear the next one. Well, I think. And he's declining, but at the same time, he's saying he'll kill you. Yeah, so, but for people who are watching who don't know what happened, when he first uh, offered to fight me, I was so pissed about the pedophile shit that I'm like, if I go in there, I'm going to kill you. It's not going to be a fight. I'm going to murder you. Like, I went, like, I was saying that. So, that's, that was my first initial reaction. And then a few days later, when it calmed down, then I, I accepted. Oh, Andy declines, but he would kill me. Really? Mm. Really, really, See. his his confidence in these are hilarious. Really, really, oh man, oh Andy, Ugh. you're a fucking, you're a pussy, bitch. Uh, here we go. Next one, fight geek. If Andy fights, is what's are, they, are they stealing the uh, fight fighting gimmick? Someone, I'm getting word they're stealing the fighting gimmick. Uh, I'll be glad uh, to fight Geek if Andy will one. fight me first. Um, who? That might be the same one. Okay, cool. And then last one was the hype break not being monetized lie. Break channel. Could, yeah. d- it didn't get monetized. He has to now pay. Figure out a way to pay. Ian Miles Chong. He don't know how to do it. So he starts up a stream. Failure wouldn't do the stream with him. So he gets pissed off and he wants to do it the same time failure stream. So now he's going to try to take away. He's like, ugh. If fucking talk and that fail. Him. I... I am so happy. Andy, pull this up. You can see where they doctored the message about the bomb threat in the first place. You can see the pixels no. on the, the part of your avatar. Yeah, pull this up. Gator has it on Twitter. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's easy to do. Are you an expert on Photoshop? You've analyzed the pixels. You, you can see. But no, but look no, at it. it. it Anybody it, can easy. see it. Like, you just got to zoom in. Oh, my God. He can't. Paint bin, Andy. It's a paint bin job. Yeah, he can't. He can't. He says he can't. <laughs> he can't send in. I can't resend till he sends me documents about a legal name change. So oh, is this happening or not? Why did you change your name? You made it. Oh, so- dude, this is the most obvious Photoshop job. I've, horrible. Whoever's listening, who did this? This is horrible. Oh, Andy, uh, your chat wants to see the picture. They want to analyze the pixels. Oh, okay. Yeah, everyone wants to analyze <laughs> okay. uh, Let me uh, um, pop the... 
Oh, look at that. Look, look at this complete detail. Okay, so let me open it. I, I got it. Yeah, yeah, I have to. I have to plus. What is it? Window capture? Is that what it is? Uh, and what's fucking what is Gator? Okay, here we go. It's not showing. Fuck. How do I? How do I capture my a window? <laughs> no, I'm serious. It's not working. It's just black. I think. I think. Yeah. You know. I oh, think. I know. Tonka oh wait, 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 wait. If wait. you have hardware, if you have accelerated whatever turned on Chrome, it won't show up. Andy, did he send you some oh. oxy berries? Is that is that what's <laughs> going on here? I wish, dude. I'm more this of this is such guy. a bad job that I can zoom in on my phone and see where that square is. Uh oh, hang on. Let me go to. I have to open up uh, a different browser. People are saying. Okay, will the other browser work? Why does th th that's so stupid? Okay, window capture. All right. Where the fuck? Uh, Ralph, can you just send him the image, like uh, uh, a link to the image, so he, so he yeah. can show it like he did the Tonka it's figure? It's not doing it. But how did I do before, though? What the fuck? I mean, it's, it's on my Twitter, if you and Gator's Twitter. After Here, I'm before, sending it to you in Discord, Andy. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I figured something out. You have hardware acceleration on, I think, on Chrome. But I don't there know. We but go. Something there we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. I need some fucking detective music for this. Okay. So, so what are we looking for right here? Just oh, well, expand the image. Yeah, click on the image so they can see. Oh, God, I can already see the pixels. <laughs> <in here. laughs> Holy shit! I didn't even try. That is miserable. Just copy and paste the gray around it, and then you you fucking keep circling. Like, what are you? Holy shit! You don't have to circle a gator. What are you doing? That is, <laughs> that is, you don't need that. That actually, uh, that, that makes it worse. That makes it harder to see actually with his, with his. Well, the one on the left is not circled. He's just showing. I mean, you don't even, yeah, you're right. You really don't have to circle it because it just, I mean, you can see right away. Wow. That is fucking miserable. Well, at least now we know who trained Kraut in the arts of this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, oh my God. What? Wow, oh my god! Oh my god, Tim just sent me all his texts. Okay, I can't resend uh, till he sends me the documents about his legal name. Okay, let me put my camera back on. Oh, okay. so he did legally change his name. So, so, so watch this. Uh, Andy wants a video of you. How does he want it? Email this to me. After that, I'll remake the contracts, but Andy insists on you having a video of you signing. Just throw it over. I don't work for Andy, blah, blah, blah. He thinks you are sending else to fight him in your place. He is just lying and wants to make demands. Me make demands. Oh, you should say, that, isn't this basic procedure for a fight that, you know, you have a photo or a video or something, not a cartoon character? Yeah. This has become just embarrassing. Okay, hang like, on. why does this need to be addressed? Like, why is this even a thing? Like, I've never seen. Because imagine what he really looks like. All right, look at this though. Look, look, hang on. Or, hang on, it's worse. It, it, it gets worse. Andy already announced the fight is off. What? No, I didn't. Did Tim sent me this? What guy living on? Tim sent me this. Andy already announced the fight is off and a bunch of contract stuff before I'm even home. If you want to just scrap it because of Andy, he's using what? it. Wow. To... What a snake. What a fucking snake. I knew he was trying to weasel out of it. And then, Anything uh, he can to uh, grasp sign, onto. Sign, sign that thing right now. Well, he, he, he has to wait till Tonka sends in his legal name. So I don't even have a fucking contra. A contract. Uh, sorry. Uh, hang on. Hang on. Uh, he said, so Tim says to him, he says that he thinks that you're using the old bait and switch. Um, uh, sorry, one sec, because now it's on a different picture here. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, on the name stuff, you apparently told, and then Tonka says, you apparently told them my name change 
and that was the whole reason I changed it to keep them from getting it. Then Tim says, um, so now he's blaming Tim for the uh, for, like for the yeah, you blame Tim. That's smart. My name is Andy Perez, you fucking from Mississauga, Ontario. You yeah, pussy ass bitch. Tim didn't tell you any name. He just said that there was a discrepancy between two of the names, and so they were sorting it out. He never gave you a name of either. I, 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 I have no name. To, like change it to something like we wouldn't figure out. Yeah. Like, what do you think he changed his name to? Well. Bobby. Well, well, if he wanted, well, if he wanted to be like really discreet, you should make himself. I, I should name himself like talented live streamer, and then no one would fucking figure that shit out. <clears throat> uh, Tim says I'm staying out of the drama, man. But this is a first for someone signing a completely different name on a bout agreement and not telling me that they changed their name. And then Tonka says. No, he doesn't. He wants to call my mother on air and harass people. I didn't do that, you faggot! Sorry. Um, then, uh, what's his face? Uh, Tim says, I didn't say what the name was at all. There you go, Metagroup. Um, just said it's not what it's been signed. And then Tonka says, it's probably a first. I can believe that, but it's also the first time I've had... Um, hang on. The first time I've been called on my shit. Let me yeah. finish that text for you. Yeah. Uh, I, I think there was. I thought there was more. Hang on. I, I might have. Okay. I wait. No, da, da, da. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. I missed a little bit here, where he goes. I don't work for Andy. He thinks you're sending out someone else to fight him, and then he, he says, says this. Andy can blow me, but I get the rest. He knows who I am and has. Has har harassed every living member of my family. He's been telling people I have I have AIDS for a week. <laughs> I can agree that this is above the typical Call of Duty. I said you had AIDS once as a joke. You called me a fucking pedophile. You contacted Sinead with fakes to get her to break up with me. You fucking went after me completely you messaged chris warski who stole five thousand dollars from me because he's a fucking motherfucker and hope he's dead um you contacted him to get information from behind the scenes about me you are the one harassing me i didn't contact your fucking mama we, can we i'm sorry we made fun of your fucking pedophile that was funny <laughs> that was funny uh but we did I, i'm sorry did we unfortunately Make fun of your pedophile stepbrother? Oh, boo-hoo. Aren't you the one who goes after pedophiles all the time? You fucking faggot. Motherfucker, get the fuck out of here. Tim, thank you for sending me this. What, you think? Like, like Tim's a fucking straight-up dude. If Tim, Tim is allowed to send Tonka anything that I text him. Tim? And technically... And he does work for Tim, and Tim is the one that runs Valor, who whose rules are to have the picture. So no, he, he was saying he doesn't work for me like that. I know. I think that's but, what, yeah. but, Tim, but he works for Tim in this case, which his rules are to have, you know, it wasn't just you saying about the photo or the, the video. That's what they do. That's the part of theirs. When you sign it, you post a picture of yourself. With the contract, I've been going above, above, above and beyond. I've literally done everything. I have literally you, you done. Did, yeah, you did everything they asked. Yeah, just it, sign it, it at this point, it. man. It's it's not on you. You've done everything that has been asked of you. You've been upfront about it. I, I know that you know you're saying one thing, Tonka's saying the other, but no one it, believes. It really, me. It, it, yeah, it doesn't look that way. It, like you had your fucking blood work in on time. The guy who's Mister Fighting is my universe didn't. Uh, you know, yeah. he didn't tell the fight promoter of name change when that could probably cause fucking issues. And if he's so into MMA and wrestling, he would know that, right? Well, it's a legal thing for the promoter. That's why he mm. has to, you know, do, go the extra mile. Even miles beyond fighting, though, name. right? Even beyond fighting, like if you're an actor, if you signed a release form to be like in like a reality show, if you're in a talent show, if you're in a band and you signed a contract to perform, any sort of fucking entertainment being on TV or anything like for that matter any type of career if you change your name 
the contracts that you have signed, you have to notify the people, especially if the contracts are still valid. And this fight has been like when he said on that fucking on the um uh, on, who are you calling? Oh, I was calling Tonka's uh, mom's car lot. <laughs> They're probably closed now, no? Yeah, they just closed. I was going to call her to tell her son to grow a pair of balls and sign the fucking contract. She's got bigger ones than he does. Yeah, it's... um, I... I and look, I'm, I'm willing for the people who bought tickets uh, for Ralph, who's joining me, Dick Masterson, mm. and Coach Red Pill, for all of you to to just tough it out for the next fucking four days and do any, any bend. I've already bent over backwards to, to the point where like doing it again, I, I'm, this has been a Cirque du Soleil of fucking setting up a fucking fight where I don't even give a fuck about fighting. Now I do though. Now I do. There's nothing more than I want to see is my fucking left knuckle. Cause I'm left-handed covered in blood. But that is like a dream of mine, just seeing blood all over my fucking knuckle. Like, yeah, I, just sign whatever they send and ma- put it all on him. Don't don't give him any outs on this. Uh, yeah, he, he's looking for anything he can grasp. Thank you. He, yeah. Oh, they called my mom. Oh, oh, oh yeah, they're harassing me. Oh, he's I looking for anything. Point, yeah, he's gonna throw away. That's what I. At this point, I think that's what he's trying to get away from. Well, he, has, could he, be wrong. Oh, well, he has AIDS, so he's probably gonna fail away because he's too light. He can't, right. <laughs> <laughs> He's such a fucking oh my god. That's, that, that's fine. Let him this. let him weigh him with his wheelchair. He'll make weight. <laughs> There's always right, the parking lot. Yeah, Andy, Andy, stick to. I gotta I gotta jump to go have dinner. But yeah, stick yeah, stick man. with it, man. You know, yeah. I'm looking forward to it. I mean, I'm already I'm already locked into watching this fucking pay per view. So I guess I'll watch other people beat each other up if uh, Chief Donga doesn't show the fuck up. But. <laughs> He's trying to he's trying to weasel out of it. Don't let him weasel out of it. Make Wait. it so he has to be a bitch and pull out. I would ask you one question this is for everyone on the panel here. So I get a few minutes in the octagon if he doesn't show up with a microphone. What should I do? Oh. What should I? Do? <laughs> I, I I was thinking maybe like like. Oh no no! You know what's that video, uh, Ralph? That you uh, that you've been playing on the kill stream, the Woke the, Wasabi one. Yeah, the good Bob Olders. Oh, dude, yeah. I used to start on my war pass with that song. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> just, the, just turn just turn that one just... out with an Indian headdress on your head. <laughs> talk, talk massive shit for the what five minutes that you had the microphone. I like the good Bob Olders idea. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we, were already, <laughs> we were already talking about renting a an Indian headdress to come no. out to the ring. No, and no, no. Work, I should just go out there because it's worse i should just dox him <laughs> yes <laughs> his I address and everything <laughs> <laughs> no i'm just kidding i'm just kidding all right well all thanks right, manager, right, man it, yeah peace yeah, out yeah, take, it, take it easy man i'm looking forward to the fight don't let him weasel out i Nails will not. Wall on it. thanks all right, for taking it easy on, buddy. holy crap